Hi guys, I'm back working on the house. Haven't been here like a month now, or even longer. Oh, nothing changed since I've been here. <laughs> this project is a bummer. Um, trying to live life intentionally, so I really want to focus on planning and executing remodeling of this house. It's hard. The hardest thing is to come here after work to focus to actually get stuff done. So I'm gonna plan around and see what I can actually do. It's getting pretty cold actually, it's about 60 degrees right now. And uh, as you know, I took off the furnace and I took apart the gas line. So before I work on the house in the winter, I need gas, I need furnace. So today I'm trying to try to unscrew the rest of the pipe because it needs to be replaced with the uh, actual black gas pipe. I don't know if you guys can see it much, but I'm in the attic right now and I, in order for me to install a new gas pipe, I need to get rid of the old one. One part is done. You know what guys, actually looks like a right pipe, like black gas pipe. Oh man, I think I just added myself some work. Okay, now I can't just put it back together, I need to put some thread sealant on it. I do have the sealant, so let's put those pipes together. So much better with the headlamp. All right, let's put this stuff together, and that's gonna save me a lot of money because this is this is an inch thick pipe, and I think I have about 60 feet here. That's a lot of pipe. All right, praise the Lord, saving money. Boy, it's hard to align this now. I think I got it. That's it, it's tight, that's good. I'm glad I had a thread sealant. Otherwise, it will be project for another day. Let's go to the next one. My gas line is ready to go. Next thing I'm gonna need to install furnace. I know a gas line looks pretty scary, but it's very simple. All you need to do is make sure there is no leaks and you can check that very easily. Besides before the gas company will turn on gas, they will pressure test it. So if something is wrong, they're not gonna connect it, so I'll have to redo it. I'm certain it's okay. This is Vladimir Nemchino of Living Life Intentionally. Thank you guys for watching. God bless you.